Gorgon Shield is an action strategy game with some roguelike elements. The goal is to take a party of up to four heroes and ascend a tower to kill Medusa. The heroes ascend on a rotating shield that they must protect from marauding monsters. Each hero protects one of four positions on the shield, but usually only one or two will be attacked directly on any floor. Heroes in the remaining positions perform supporting roles such as ranged attacks, healing, repairing the shield, or gathering treasure, with the player spinning the shield to change who does what. A boss appears every 10 floors, but before that, the player has to clear a labyrinth. This is a substantial change in gameplay style, with the player navigating a short dungeon in a limited amount of time before the ferryman catches up to the heroes. Depending on your perspective, this could be a nice way to mix up the gameplay, or it could be an annoyance. The difficulty in Gorgon Shield ramps up fast, and that's where upgrades come into play. After a run in the tower, the player can spend any gold earned on various upgrades, including new hero types, enhancements to existing heroes, assorted passive bonuses, and runes which can be used to trigger powerful, customizable active abilities. This adds an incremental element to the game. The upgrades won't help you win on their own but they will make the gameplay feel just a little bit more forgiving, especially in the top half of the tower. The gameplay is certainly novel, and most players are going to figure out the basic strategies very quickly. However, there is a heavy luck element at play, which can be frustrating at times. The long-term incremental growth may also be either a plus or a minus, depending on your perspective. Overall, Gorgon Shield is the kind of game meant to be played in short sessions over a long period of time. 